Here again, we want to evaluate an argument with a diagram. This is another deductive argument where we start with a general rule, all firefighters know CPR, and go from there to a specific example. So the premises are that, first of all, all firefighters know CPR. Then the next conclusion, the next premise is that Jill knows CPR and the argument claims that it is proven that Jill is a firefighter. Now it should be clear just by looking at that that that's not a valid argument because you might imagine there are some people who know CPR who are not firefighters, nurses and doctors and so on. But we can illustrate this with a diagram. Remember the word all, that universal quantifier, has a diagram that looks like this where we have everyone who knows CPR here, and then within that we have firefighters. So everyone who's inside the firefighter circle is also inside the circle of those who know CPR. But just knowing that Jill knows CPR, just knowing that she's in the outer circle, there's no way to tell whether she's in the inner circle or not. So there's no way to conclude that she must be a firefighter based solely on these premises. So this is an invalid argument. And we can use this diagram to illustrate that.